Well, welcome back. And the next project that you guys have to do is you're going to be wiring up three different loads to this light switch. Now, those three loads that we're going to be hooking up to the light switch are going to be the light bulb that was previous. It's going to be a electric heater. And then we're going to use uh, some sort of shaded pole fan motor that only requires two wires to be hooked with it. So schematic wise, as we are looking at this device, what we want to do is we want to put our L1 power source coming from the outlet that's out there. When I was speaking, when I was speaking about a whip that needs to be installed, you're going to be cutting the cord off of some sort of appliance that has that outlet that we can plug into an extension cord or directly into the wall and we're going to run it into a 2x4 box, put a switch on there, and then run our other pieces of equipment off of that. Now there's three loads that we want to hook up. Let's go ahead and put those three loads up here. We have our light bulb, okay, our LB, our light bulb. The next uh, one is our electric heater. So we'll just make an electric symbol for an electric heater uh, as it's going through. And then our next one will be a fan motor. Okay, all of these are going to be hooked up in parallel with the power supply and then we're going to bring those back into the neutral to complete the circuit board. So we'll come out and we'll come into a uh, manual switch that's going to be on there. It's going to be normally open and then from that switch we want to go ahead and take it to the heater, to the fan, and then to the light bulb. Now remember we need to complete the circuit so we will complete the circuit back to our neutral in some way, shape, or form from the light bulb to neutral, from the heater to neutral, and from the fan to neutral. Now, once we have ran all of the conductors and all of these different wires to these different loads, then uh, once we turn on the switch, the actual loads will heat up, uh, the light bulb will turn on, and then the fan will turn on. Uh, completing the circuit as we are closing that manual switch right there. Well, good luck, and there you go. There's the schematic drawing for it. Go ahead and grab your boards and then try to, try to wire this guy up.